Dear friends, welcome to the video content on improvement in food resources, part 2. In this content, we will learn animal husbandry, cattle farming, breeding in cattle, feeding management of the cattle, disease management of the cattle, poultry farming, egg and broiler production, fish production that is pisciculture and beekeeping that is apiculture. Animal husbandry. The scientific management of animal livestock including their feeding, breeding and disease control is called animal husbandry. Animal farming includes cattle, sheep, goat, poultry and fish farming. Animal farming or animal husbandry requires planning for domestic animal shelter, breeding, health, disease control and proper economic utilization. The expanding population and scaling demands have resulted in the limitation in livestock breeding. Therefore, there is no need to improve these techniques. Cattle farming. Cattle farming is done for two purposes, for milk production and for drought labor for agriculture. Milk producing females are called milch animals and for farm labor are called drought animals. Indian cattle mainly includes one cows, the scientific name is Bos indicus, two buffaloes, the scientific name is Bos bubalis. Cows are adapted for drier regions of the country, while buffaloes are well adapted to wet areas and river beds. Milk production is highly nutritious because of the presence of all major nutrients like carbohydrates, proteins, fat, minerals and vitamins. Most of the milk is obtained from cows and buffaloes. Milk produced by buffaloes is much higher in quantity with rich in nutrients compared to cows. The production of milk from cattle mostly depends on the lactation period of the animal. So milk production can be increased by increasing lactation period. Breeding in cattle. India has many popular breeds of cows and buffaloes. Dairy cows can be broadly divided into three categories. One, indigenous breeds. They are desi or local breeds and are native to India. This breed shows excellent resistance to diseases, for example, Red Sindhi and Sahiwal. Foreign or exotic breeds. These breeds have long lactation period, for example, Jersey and Brown Swiss. Number three, crossbreeds. The breeds chosen for crossbreeding have a set of favorable characters that may become part of the animal that is born as a result of crossbreeding, for example, Curran Swiss. Feeding management of cattle. Cattle requires two kinds of food during breeding. One for maintenance requirement. It contains all nutrients for the maintenance of health of cattle. Two for milk production. Food contains specific requirement during lactation period. It thus increases the duration of lactation period and increases the milk yield. Component of cattle feed. Cattle feed should include one roughage. 2. Concentrates and 3. Feed additives. Disease management of cattle. Healthy animals always feed regularly and have a normal posture. Diseases adversely affect the production of milk and causes mortality of sick animal. Cattle diseases are caused by parasites, bacteria and viruses. The parasites of the cattle are of two types. One, external parasite they live on skin and cause skin diseases and number two internal parasites examples are worms and flukes worms affect the stomach and intestine while flukes damage the liver infectious diseases can be spread to other animals in the farm also to human beings these diseases can be bacterial like anthrax and tuberculosis or viral like cowpox or foot and mouth diseases for prevention against viral and bacterial infection vaccination must be given to the farm animals poultry farming poultry farming is the breeding of fowls for eggs production and for the meat which are the best sources of proteins and fats birds which are farmed for eggs are called layers and those for meat purposes are called broilers breed of hen it is divided into three categories indigenous breed these are desi breeds and are native to india these breeds show excellent resistance to diseases, example are Asil and Kadaknath. Number 2 Foreign or Exotic Breeds 
these breeds lay more number of eggs and also give more meat compared to the indigenous breeds example is white leghorn number 3 is cross breeding the breeds chosen for cross breeding have a set of desirable characters that may become a part of the offspring during a result of cross breeding for example grama priya following features can be achieved by cross breeding number 1 increased fertility and egg laying capacity of the fowl number 2 increased meat yield number 3 low maintenance requirements number 4 large size eggs number 5 less diet requirements number 6 increase in tolerance to high temperature and summer adaptation capability and number 7 reduce size of layers with ability to utilize more fibrous and cheaper diet made by using agricultural by product egg and broiler production The production of eggs and broilers requires special care for nutrition, shelter and disease control. Broiler chickens are always fed with vitamins, proteins and fat-rich feed for better growth. Poultry care. For good production of poultry birds, they are given proper nutrition and kept in hygienic conditions and proper temperature conditions. The food provided to them should be protein-rich with adequate amount of fats and high amount of vitamin A and K. disease management poultry birds suffer from number of viral fungal and bacterial diseases the poultry birds may also be affected by parasites and nutritional deficiencies the birds can be protected from various diseases by adopting following measures one proper cleaning and sanitation of their living area number two spraying of disinfectants at regular intervals number three for prevention against bacterial and viral diseases vaccination must be given to the poultry birds fish production that is pisciculture fishes are important aquatic food and are the source of animal protein in our food fish are highly nutritious and easily digestible fish liver oil is rich in vitamin a and vitamin d two ways of obtaining fish are one capture fishing from natural resources two culture fishery from fish farming the water source of fish can be sea water or fresh water like river ponds and lakes number 1 marine fisheries india has an extensive coastline and an exclusive sea zone beyond it popular marine fishes are prawnfed mackerel tuna sardines and bombadil these fish are captured from coastal areas marine fishes are caught using fishing nets from boats and large trawlers number 2 fresh water fisheries India has large number of fresh water sources like rivers ponds lakes capture fisheries are poor in fresh water so major fish production from fresh water is carried out through culture called aquaculture sometimes fish farming is also carried out in paddy fields common fresh water fishes are rohu and mrigal bee keeping that is apiculture honey is an economically important and obtained from honey bees Beekeeping practice is called apiculture. It is done for both honey and bee wax. Honey is known to have various medicinal value. Wax is used in medicinal preparations and for making polishes. The variety of bees are used for commercial honey production. These are Apis cirrhana indica. It is an Indian bee. Apis dorsata. It is rock bee. Apis flore. It is little bee. Apis melfera. it is an italian bee an italian variety of bee have high honey collection capacity so it is also being used for large scale production of honey the bees collect nectar from flowers and is convert into honey in the bee hives bees are artificially grown in apiaries and the honey is extracted by machine called honey extractors test yourself the following are a few questions for you please revise the concept by answering them on your own this content was developed under aka school project this project is funded by nme ict and mhrd government of india in order to contact us mail us at the given email id thank you